Chevrolet Suburban 11th Generation, 2015-2020 The 11th Generation Chevrolet Suburban, GMC Yukon XL, and Yukon Denali XL were introduced to the public on September 12, 2013, and GM unveiled the vehicles in different locations, the Suburban in New York, Yukon XL in Los Angeles, on that date. Both vehicles are based on the GMT K2XX platform and will carry unique serial designated numbers, identified by platform, K2, brand, K for Chevrolet, K for GMC, drive train, C for 2WD, K for 4WD, tonnage, 15 for half ton, 25 for 3 fourths ton, 35 for 1 ton, wheelbase, 7 for short, 9 for long, and Mo 6 for SUV which means that a K2 K15906 would be identified as a Chevrolet Suburban 1504 WD. The Suburban and Yukon XL went on sale in February 2014 as a 2015 model, with the vehicles built exclusively in Arlington, Texas. The newly redesigned Suburban and Yukon XL were showcased to the public for the first time on September 27, 2013 at the State Fair of Texas. This move comes on the heels of the 80th anniversary of the first production of the Suburban in 1934. The designs and concepts were created by GM's exterior design manager Chip Thole, before his transfer to GM's Buick Design Studio in 2013, who told Trend, I start with what intuition tells me about the market and get the team going on that. You look at trends around the industry, fashion, culture what people are buying, what they say they want now, and project that into the future. The fun part is putting those ideas to paper and going from there. He then added, we wanted to take what was good about today's vehicles, bring that forward and make them new and different with that spark of freshness that people recognize, without making them gimmicky or overdone. Thal also challenged his design team to help bring ideas to the SUVs which lead to the split headlamps and a more graphic feel for the suburban design, while a more industrial but sculptured look was added to the Yukon XL to give it a unique identity of its own.